And now to a CBN Sport News exclusive on a special day for dozens of local middle school students who were recognized for being on the honor roll. Miami Day School Superintendent Alberto Carvalho took the kids to lunch, but as CBS Sports Jacqueline Quinn reports, it was more or less on how a little recognition can go a long way. Last quarter, my grades were two C's and all B's. So, honor roll, I was like, mm, maybe. Good grades don't always tell the whole story. Natalie Thomas is in the health magnet program at Horace Mann Middle School. Uh, the other day, we were um, analyzing bacteria and how we were um, learning how to grow bacteria. Take a plate. She's one of 60 kids that were bused to Boteca Restaurant in Miami Wednesday morning. And I am happy that we're here today. Why? Because many of them don't get out. And they don't hear congratulations as much as they should. Uh, Horace Mann is a school with a very high level of poverty, uh, with a high level of students who are still learning English. A very diverse school, but a beautiful school. But it takes caring adults, whether they are teachers, restaurant owners, to say, we partner, we embrace our kids, we feed them, we love them, and we teach them. So the idea to reward honor students came as Superintendent Alberto Carvalho watched soccer with Boteco owners. I, I graduated from Hialeah High, Pine Springs Junior High. So yes, I, I have been, I am a product of the community as well. They teamed up with other local businesses to give these students a day of gifts, food, games, and even brought in an eyeglass company to help those who needed new frames. It feels amazing, and it is a big honor, especially because we're from Horace Man. And I'm glad that the teachers and the staff members decided to do this for us. It's a simple meal today with a little bit of good beats, if you can hear that. But this may be a lasting memory for some students to help them stay motivated into the future to get those good grades. In Miami, I'm Jacqueline Quinn, CBS 4 News.